Welcome to Local Distortion. On this podcast, I'll be talking to the best up-and-coming independent artists and bands. I am your host, Daniel Kirk. So my guest this week are the visitors. Welcome to the show. Hello. Hello. You come, Yo. Come, Yo. <laughs> you come Yo. all the way down from Norwich, don't you? Yeah. 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 Thank you for... <laughs> give oh, up your thanks, Saturday thanks. to come down. That's right. And the oh, I miss season. breakfast for the <laughs> <No. laughs> full English. Don't make me feel guilty. <laughs> to be it. Right. Would you like to go around the room and introduce yourselves? Okay. And I think both look to me first. So I'm Lily. I I do the singing thing. <laughs> <laughs> and I really like to sing. Oh, I, I like really singing. like singing. I'm Lou and I play guitar. Uh, I'm Simon and I do guitar as well <laughs> and some backing vocals yes. we should probably shout out Lou the people shout too. out the band who the rest of the band who isn't here we've yeah. got nathaniel laker on the bass and connor i can't Hirsch. Hirsch. is it Hirsch? Hirsch. I keep saying, he wants to say Hirsch. he's gonna listen to this and hate you <laughs> yeah, for the rest of the way anyway. how long have you been in the band with him oh i don't <laughs> like, i don't he's just a drummer months. don't pay that much attention <laughs> you just call like him the really drummer you. yeah the drummer i just hit things so we'll, we'll give them a shout because they're not here bless yeah. them okay can you describe yourselves in just three words now, as there's three of you, maybe maybe a word each. A word each. Yeah. It doesn't have to be, like, genre-specific. Can it be, like, you say one, I'll say one, and who's Yeah, yeah, one? yeah. That's, yeah. Go on, yeah. That's what you um. just said. <laughs> Sorry. I'm dyslexic Blues like is mad. confused. <laughs> it, it's early. We'll let you off. Yeah. <laughs> um. I can cut out this awkward silence as well. <laughs> no, I think you should keep it in. It's brilliant. This is good. This is going to be the entirety of the podcast. Have you ever put someone on the spot? <laughs> <laughs> Say a word. <laughs> One word. Well, I can think of a short. <laughs> That's nothing to do with Describing you, not the band. Yeah, but that could be something like short, catchy... Beard. I don't, I don't know. Um, <laughs> Sorry, it was the thing I saw when I looked at you. <laughs> um, Help me. Oh, my God. Uh, I don't know. I'd 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 say um, go this way then. Yeah, let's go yeah, this go way. The way. I'd, oh, I'd, I'd say vibrant. Like on stage, I think we've got quite a good presence, and the gigs are quite vibrant. Okay. I don't know. I forgot. To say. <laughs> <laughs> Lily's like dropped this on me now. Oh, so you're saying I? vibrant? You were yeah. Be so next like the band's anyway. very. This vibrant. is either like the easiest question or the hardest. Question. It is. <laughs> so you'll ask us a question now, like, ah, oh, when did nineteen? 19- I don't know. You know, um, you know when I said like we've got to be a song for six. I don't think we can no, make no. it. <laughs> Stuck on question two. Can do it any later? <laughs> this is the first question. Yeah. Yeah. Oh god. Um, I'd say energetic. Everyone says that. Great. Okay, so, so, no, so I'll go for something else then. Yeah. Deep. <laughs> We're not a pizza. Deep, deep dish. <laughs> Would you like me your 14-inch margarita? I love the visitors. Deep dish. <laughs> deep dish. But it's got to be vegan because Lily's vegan. Oh, I've got to say. She likes vegetables. Okay, so we can have vegan deep Vegan. vegan There you go, that's how you describe the band. Vegan. vegan You're the only vegan one in it. I like trays. A vibrant a short vegan, vegan pizza. Dish. There you go. There we go. Um, it's a brand deal. Wolves. <laughs> can I say enthusiastic? No, you can't say that. <laughs> oh sorry. I've already said it. No, you, you said I mean it. energetic, sorry. That's different. Sorry. Yeah. Like say different then. <laughs> different. There you go. Different. <laughs> so what was it? Vib- Sorry. Vibrant. <laughs> I forgot. It was such a long time yeah, ago. Vi- vibrant, I think. Yeah. Deep. Deep. <laughs> and different. different. <laughs> it's the new album, guys. <laughs> vibrant, deep and different. <laughs> I'm no, really no, no, no. I, I quite like I quite like those. Cause cool. the yeah, the lyrics are quite deep on some songs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what's going for? Yeah. Was not thinking about Domino's last night. <laughs> <laughs> You're just hungry. <laughs> I mean it has a double meaning with pizza, I guess, so that's yeah. kinda cool. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Alright. Cool, we'll, pass it, we'll pass yeah. the first question. <laughs> first question done. Lou Seven, so aka okay. Deep Dish. <laughs> Deep Seven. Oh. That was one of 30. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> it's get, like, get it's like a test. <laughs> I didn't revise. You failed. <laughs> you must stay longer. <laughs> <sighs> Come back tomorrow. <laughs> Come back tomorrow. <laughs> stay, stay overnight. I miss breakfast again. <laughs> Keep the door locked. <laughs> <laughs> Don't let them <laughs> Feed them to the ducks. <laughs> <laughs> like a shark trying to dangle Lily over yeah. the ducks. Oh my god. Oh, brilliant. I haven't fed them today, so. Oh. 
You're going to have to uh, like edit out so much. It's going to take you so long. I'm so sorry. No, I'm just going to leave all in. It's, yeah, oh, okay. It's, 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 it's no point. <laughs> it's just going to be a confuffle of like misconfusion. Two hour long. Yeah. Yeah. None of that I mean, will work. I'm going to go out there on a limb and say this, this question should be easy. Right, okay. Right. <laughs> How did the band come together? Deep. <laughs> so, uh, um, started with um, me and you, wasn't it? Yeah, yes, we, it, was me, it was me and you, was me? just like right, obviously just jamming, writing some acoustic and some more electric stuff. And I met Lily through Buskin, just through yeah, just through Buskin. I was just going through uh, Norwich. Yeah, we found this hobo. <laughs> <laughs> we found this hobo, and found they were busy, the street, so we got Lily. So we didn't have a dog, so we didn't stop. But then we heard her <laughs> sing. Yeah, well, yeah, I, I just heard Lily singing, and I said to her that was. You know, like obviously that she's amazing, and that I really liked her vocals. And I said to her, no. "So just some random bearded guy come up to you on the street, yeah. I, give you, you a compliment?" No, to be terrified. Hey. <laughs> and the thing was, that I didn't want to be. The thing I didn't want to be creepy and be like, "Oh, here's my number." So I gave you my email address. <laughs> yeah. And then like really here's formal. My e- card. <laughs> yeah, yeah, really. So, formal. It was so formal. You were like, uh, "This is Simon Richardson, dear Lillian, um, <laughs> yeah. yours sincerely." I was like. Yeah, no. well, I didn't. I didn't, like, I didn't, I didn't who know. died? <laughs> <laughs> who writes emails like that? I would love to have seen your MySpace. Well, the, 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 the thing was, like, the emails went on. They got less formal. It was like it went from like. That always Lillian. happens with me as well. Yeah, yeah. it used to go from like Kind Lillian Lillian to like yeah. yo yeah. and, and to just like, like sup, <laughs> bye. But um, <laughs> no, yeah. So it was me and you just uh, writing music, and then met Lily. Yeah. And then you, you brought it to the band. But when me and you started writing yeah. stuff, that was for a different band, wasn't it? That yeah, never ever took off. No, and, and so we decided. Like you said to me, you sat me down when I was. Outside. I've got this singer. I've got someone in mind. I don't know if you want to do it, mm. but I really want to start writing some like <laughs> old school sort of punk sort of mixed Rocky with a bit of pop, so yeah. it's still soft, but it's still like energetic. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you can throw that in there. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, everyone else does. Um, and then obviously Lily came to her first practice with us and that, and then we started writing acoustic stuff. And then we got we actually wrote for Sard, didn't we? Well, we yeah we we wrote text me for Sard and reason for the day yeah and we re- re-recorded those three songs with just us with yeah. Jacob Loveday on drums and then we 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 had them on SoundCloud and stuff and eventually you brought in Connor and Nathaniel from college yeah no you brought Connor in I yeah you brought Connor met, in first we actually met in the city. And he was sort of panicking because we, you said to him, learn our songs. Yeah, that's and he right. said he had. And he, and he had. Said them. He had them. I said it that day. I was like, we're, oh, we're no, outing him now. Yes. You know? he still you hasn't have been figured out. <laughs> he still hasn't learned them. <laughs> I was like, Connor, do you want to come Thank to a band God practice a tonight? <laughs> yeah, and then then Nathaniel joined, and like we've only actually been gigging since April, yeah. so not even a full year of gigging. No. Yeah, but, it's, um, it's quality though, because like as soon as we started, like. I had a, like a goal, like my old band and all that lot. Like, we started gigging for like a couple of years, and then we literally only just hit like seven hundred likes. But that was yeah. a big thing for me. Mm. And then yeah. when we started, it literally just kept racking up, and now we're on like six hundred odd. Well, we're yeah. close like, to seven hundred. We've only been going less than yeah, a year. We've achieved, <laughs> yeah, we've achieved that, which is mind blowing. Like we we've gone from a three piece with three songs, and now we've got eight, and like some of them have got like seven thousand five hundred. Yeah. So, you know, it's cra- it's crazy to think how far we've come in just a year and how much more's ahead, yeah, which oh, I yeah, think which is, which is brilliant. Yeah, it's a really good well, start, definitely. Mm. <laughs> good. <It's my> input. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so now we're going to go all the way back to the beginning of your musical oh. journeys. <laughs> oh, cool. Deep. What? <laughs> yeah. Here, God. Here we'll get... I swear to God. It's <laughs> a great way to stay in shape. <laughs> uh, what was the first album you guys ever brought with your own money? Ooh, oh no! That's a good one. That is yeah. a good one. Oh, no. You gotta be honest as well. You can't just say something cool if it was bad. Oh, <laughs> Purple God. Rain by Prince. Was that actually? Yeah, really. That's good. Yeah. Wow. So I love Prince. Like a physical copy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Damn. Well, I don't know. You, you don't like have the first one with you on <laughs> iTunes. Then. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I suppose you're not as old school as me. Like had to buy physical stuff. So. I think. Oh no, I love buying CDs. <laughs> oh, no, I absolutely. Love. I'll get vinyls now. Back in my day, it was bang, my bang, bang, <laughs> bang, bang day on Bebo. <laughs> <laughs> bang rocks together for sound. I think the first one I ever bought was um, Queens of Stone Age. I can't remember which album. It's the, it was the red one. one. Yeah, it's not, yeah, the <laughs> red, yeah, the like red one. <laughs> I, I can't remember what it's called. It's I'm very red. Absolutely crucified for it. Then the one with like the. The fork, fork on it. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the red one. Yeah, <laughs> I'm just trying to think of the name. But of was it? 
deep. I go, <laughs> go with the flow. It has that song on. Probably. Yeah, go with the flow. No one knows. Like, that was uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Sweet lord. <laughs> Headbutt the mic. He's going to have like, the headphones that just go... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Cool. yeah, no, that, that, that was my first album. What about you, He's probably deafened someone. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Lou used to be a UFC fighter. <laughs> Stop headbutting oh Lily, what's your first album? Um, my first album that I ever bought on iTunes was JLS. Oh, <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Oh lord! It was it was like I don't know if it was called Beat Again or Everybody in Love or something. But it was one of those. It, wasn't it had it? those songs on it. Yeah, it was great. <laughs> you still listen to it? No. <laughs> <laughs> we had it in the car all the way here. Didn't we? Yeah. <laughs> that and Believer. Yeah. Two and a half hour drive. <laughs> oh oh man. man, that'd be painful. Jeez. Just crash the car. The ruining part is you was barricaded into the back, so we couldn't even attack you. So much fear, <laughs> all over you. So let's talk about the debut album, I guess. Yeah. Sweet. EP slash album. It's a self-titled album. The Visitors yeah. by the Visitors by the Visitors by the Visitors. <laughs> yeah. Too many. Chill mm. out. Like, yeah. By the Visitors. That's by Visitors. <laughs> I swear to God. Yeah. Uh, I've said that so many times. I'm, I'm just, just I'm sick of you talking. <laughs> Sorry. Um, <laughs> this had a serious answer. <laughs> <laughs> right, so a it's debut a album is yeah. an eight-tracked album mm. with, obviously, it's called The Visitors by the Visitors. And yeah, yeah. We, <laughs> <Sick>. <laughs> it was, oh, no, sorry. It was recorded in Crystal Sound Studio by Jack Murphy himself from Youth Killed It. Yeah, yeah. great band. Yeah, quality. He's cool. a good laugh as well. Yeah, yeah. 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 definitely recommend. Yeah, man, going, cool. <laughs> that's it. Right, definitely recommend going there oh, if yeah. anyone wants music recorded. <laughs> just, well, yeah, no, no. Just, yeah. Like great. compared to other studios as well, he has. He like more cares of a home about what you're based doing. sort of studio. It's not. It's it's, it's, it's that. And it's like I, I know someone who will pay like upwards of two hundred pound for I think like a few hours yeah. in a day. But Jack will be right. We'll start at ten, and if we run until one in the morning, yeah. so be it. And like it's hundred quid, hundred and a bit a day. So that's really good. No, he's yeah, he's good. really good, he's and like, he really well. knows the stuff. But yeah. I think the album went quite well. We had a car crash in the middle of it, which is quite nice. That was yeah, funny. But... <laughs> that wasn't funny. I was in it. Yeah. <laughs> was not... But wait, what happened? Uh... Oh, me and me and the bassist because he can't drive. <laughs> uh, we we went <laughs> we um we were, we were, like went to go get like nibbles and food and decided he just decided to have a crash, which was quite nice. <laughs> Into the back so, of a BMW. The back it? of a BMW. Oh god. So yeah, it, was it was full. It was full of drama and fun. Yeah. But, I had uh, to rush him into the A and E while you guys were getting drunk at the studio, having the times of your life. Yeah, no, we were having a right. I was panicking that everyone was dying in a car crash. <laughs> I was just laying on bed. I was just chill. Yeah, I was like, "You're right." You're like, "Yeah." I'll tell you what, everyone's fighting though. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, everyone's fine. Yeah, yeah no. No, apart yeah. from the BMW thing. Well, well, in, well in, in the, the BMW front of his was car, right. Nathaniel's car got Nathaniel's punched. Car was... <laughs> Rest in peace. <laughs> R.I.P. Forever. Rest in peace, Suzuki. Rest in pepper. Rest in pepper. Yeah, no, I, yeah, the album We've completely gone off topic. Yes. We've done that for every question. Sorry. <laughs> it was deep. Um, <laughs> anyway, God. Okay. Be my so, challenge. would you like to do like a track commentary of like each track? Oh yeah. Maybe. Should we pick you know, a track a couple each? Of, yeah, yeah. A couple and say of centered, what we think. That yeah, yeah. You maybe you pick your favourite tracks and. And everyone else will tell you that you're wrong. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? You're not allowed to speak. <laughs> <laughs> So well, you go first. What, what's your yeah, favourite track on the album? Summary of the my tracks. my favourite track would be Not Giving Up because I think it it's it's the intro track and I think it's got a the way like it kicks in, it gives you a good feel for the rest of the album, it kind of kick starts and it progresses really nicely. It's got some bits where it dies down to just me and Lou on the guitar and then the whole band kicks in and dies down. It's di- dynamically I think it's great and lyrically the message behind it is quite Nice as well. It, it's yeah. uh, overall, I, 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 I don't know. It's short, snappy, gets to the point. It's quite good. That's why I, I, I find it. Anyway. Wow. wow. You okay? No. I'm still thinking. <laughs> <laughs> you like carry on because you, you do one. most of them. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, I'll do carry on then. With carry on, it's like it's obviously like a slower track, and it's quite sad because it. It's, I kind of wrote it, like, I wrote the lyrics about depression and anxiety and all that fun stuff. And, um, <laughs> like all the other songs. Um. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, like most of the other songs. But, um, <laughs> um, but yeah, for me, Carry On is, like, the first time I kind of performed it on stage, it was, like, 
kind of a battle with trying not to cry <laughs> and like concentrating on singing in tune as well. But like it's, but in the end, it's kind of like it's something that kind of needs to be talked about. So I'm glad that it is talked about by us in a way. Yeah, and it's a really like powerful song as well. Like that song really stuck out for me when I was listening back oh. to the album as well. well, along with a couple of others. But I would say like. Pretty much all of them, like all eight, are pretty solid tracks, and there's not sort of like a weak link in no. the oh, iPhone. Nice yeah. Which well, is that's quite solo, though. <laughs> 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 Which is, you know, sometimes that's really hard to do, and bands sometimes struggle to put like four <coughs> solid tracks together, and you've you've got eight solid tracks there. So. Cheers. Sweet. What's your? I Mine's impossible. Yeah, I love Impossible. I think the story Only behind it's funnier. The story behind it was literally me and you were trying to write a song that was completely different to it, and then me and you were like, "Should we write your typical pop punk song?" Yeah, and we was like, "Let's go for something that's really trashy as well yeah, and quite no, funny." About high school to start with. Like, you like, oh, yeah, some pop song. It's totally great. Dude. No, it was, it, was so, it was so different to that. I think it was like, "Fuck school, I don't want to go to prom." <laughs> And I said, and that's and that so was, and I was just like, well, let's do that again. And I figured out on guitar, and then yeah. that's, that's and the then we came room. up with the hook line. And then we was just like, let's make it really trashy by putting loads of power chords in the background. It's brilliant. A couple of snare slaps in there. That was quality. Yeah. 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 <laughs> that was, it is brilliant. I love it though because it's like everyone relates to that sort of thing. Like when you listen to all the other stuff, it's very sort of heavier. Whereas yeah, this one's yeah. still got that high major sort of vibe to it as yeah. so it's quite nice but yeah that's it cool yeah, yeah. it's a great way to stay in shape <laughs> <laughs> alright so now we're going to play a track oh my. would you like to pick one that you'd want to play Ooh. yeah off the album <laughs> yeah uh, <laughs> yeah look at me look at me now <laughs> that's not one of us yeah price no. I don't by remember. Jesse James I don't. oh yeah I remember that. should we start with not no. giving up because it's a title track no no. <laughs> oh, no. no. Why we go all day? No, no. Even, watercolors. Even, oh, yeah, watercolors yeah, are watercolors. a good one. Watercolors, definitely. <laughs> Got excited. <laughs> good.
from the shore. So let's clear our heads. I can't stand this anymore. Take me far away. All I need is you and watercolored seas. So, what are your future plans for 2018? Quit. <laughs> <laughs> Quit while you're ahead. We've got 700 likes. We're finished. That's, that's it. That's the goal. Sit, that's no, all you get. <laughs> One album. <laughs> and what? We've got quite a lot going on, yeah. really. We've got... Um, that guy. Yeah, we've, we're currently in talks with someone who... May be interested in managing. In, yeah, which will take a lot of stress off us. Or promoting. One of the two. Well, yeah, no, just, just, yeah. Don't, don't know. just don't hand him over too much money. No, no, we won't. Yeah. He's getting a pound an hour. He's getting a pound, <laughs> pound, pound, pound an hour. Pound an hour of <laughs> Harry Bo. <laughs> there are some dodgy managers oh, yeah. out there. Just well, make sure you get a good one. We're, we're quite saying. lucky that me and uh, me and Lou know him. Me, me, and, me and Lou know him from like high school. That oh, okay. he's, he's, he's like because high school never ends. That's deep, man. That was deep. That was deep. This guy's like quite a general. He's a good. He's a good guy, and I think having a manager would take some stress off us in regards of like booking and public, um, br- like uh, promoting ourselves. But we've well, got the thing is, we can now focus on like our own social side. media, the music side, mm. instead yeah. of having to ring up gigs every songs. other weekend. Yeah. That's one thing I would definitely things. say. Like, make sure your social media is always oh, you yeah. guys. Yeah. There's a lot of bands there, like oh, just get the manager to do it, and it just yeah. it looks corporate, doesn't it? Yeah, and the the writing just become generic and you can just tell that it's not yeah, the bands and that kind of puts people <laughs> off a lot when they see your posts and stuff and government it feels like they can't government. really connect with you in yeah. a way so no definitely yeah always <laughs> always keep your own social media i'd say yeah oh, we're quite good well we've got quite a lot at the minute we well yeah we've got twitter no I was, I was instagram <laughs> my facebook myspace bebo we haven't got bebo kick we've got snapchat <laughs> We do. We don't use it though. Yeah, no. <laughs> we shouldn't really say that. Just well, like, I like oh, social media. Kind of funny, you say really. we've got Snapchat, but all I've sent on there is you taking pictures of like floors, saying streaks. <laughs> oh, so, no, don't make the band one of those. Popular people. one. <laughs> but I think for twenty, no, we've got well, we've got obviously talks of people like you know obviously interested in managing or promoting, but then we've mm. also got quite Festivals. a few. Ge- yeah, we've got um, <clears throat> we've got some talks of some festivals abroad, which we might be oh, that's cool. going yeah. to. We've is got that- some. Swedish rock fest, isn't it? Yeah, I hope we're waiting for stuff. Oh, Back really from then, we've got some back. gigs in good. Germany, which went to be confirmed. Yeah, yeah, man, that'd be sweet. So, yeah. if, if anything, some Jäger schnitzel. Jäger schnitzel. If anything, we're waiting. We're trying to push ourselves out of Norfolk a bit more. Yeah. Like, yeah. There, there are a lot of there are a lot of good bands in Norfolk, but they they stay they stay there either because. They well, can't get out, or that they don't want to. Like they, they all... kind of get in a safe zone, don't they? They know yeah. they can pull a certain crowd, so they're the just thing. like, mm. we don't it... want to be known as like, yeah, the local band. Yeah, if that makes yeah. sense. Like yeah. we, I want to be known mm. from like obviously being Norwich area. Yeah, so like, oh, you want to be known locally, but England, you don't want to be Norwich. known for being local. I don't want to be known for like, oh, if you go to this gig, <laughs> they're always there. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they're always they're playing. funded mm. by. The visitors. Yeah, it, it's it's. I was saying to you when I the other day, I was like, I really want to do gigs like London based and like Manchester, Liverpool. London's pretty dead these days. It is, yeah, but it's different to where we are. Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, <laughs> play one because yeah, it will look good. Just do it for experience, like, though. That's the thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, I think the hardest thing is finding where the music scene actually is now nowadays. in England because we got a great one down here. So is actually yeah. I've never well, Cambridge. It, yeah, I've, I've obviously being a bit ignorant. I've what kind of venues are there in Cambridge. There's um, there's a couple of ones like we got one similar size to the waterfront, but they do like occasional 
nights where they'll put on local acts or smaller bands and they'll all play together for like five pounds and that's kind of cool because they get to play on a massive stage which is good so that's usually where like people get like most of their live videos done because it looks pretty epic yeah but um, yeah, we've got some cool little venues as well. Mm. Oh, I like the what, 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 we'll have to look into Yeah, 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 the yeah. junction. That's yeah, the I think well, yeah. if, if we're going to start branching out with Marsville Browns slowly, unless Cambridge isn't too far away. Yeah. No. And I know yeah. Cambridge as well because you still And I'm here. booking gigs as well, <laughs> so I could maybe sort you out a gig. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> <laughs> some handsome man. On the <laughs> <laughs> Does he want some food? <laughs> 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 and a deep dish, yes, please. <laughs> 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 but no, that's pretty much at 2018. Are you yeah. doing a new music video as well? Yes. Oh, yes. I saw that. Yes, we've got yes, one yeah. next week. I can't believe you've got that. Yeah. <laughs> that <laughs> you sorted this out, out, didn't you? Is <laughs> that, <laughs> that going to be for a new song? No, that, that's no. Gonna, it's going to be... No. Not giving it's, up. It's, 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 a, it's a Top of the pop style thing, so if you met, so... Like the cheesy old Top of the pops thing? Kind of. It, <laughs> it makes but it sound so wild. It's um, in a sense of... We'll obviously not be miming the song, the song will be in the background. But yeah, yeah. Well, that's the standard music video. Yeah, isn't it? yeah that's a good yeah. point. I don't know why I decided <laughs> to be like, it's so actually good. terrible. But, um, <laughs> thank you for describing to everyone that's ever done one yeah. <laughs> um, what they did. <laughs> um, i tell you what, you are on form. Yeah. You are so deep. Fire. So deep. Um, um, yeah, so we've got a music video next week, which should be quite good. So and we're then, looking we're looking forward to it as well because it's sort of like it'll be fun. it's our first ever official one. Like our facade video that went on YouTube was sort of like a mess about sort of like bearing in mind mm. I can't remember her name this Emma. Really, that's it, sorry. <laughs> bearing in mind Emma is lovely and mm. she knows what she's doing, like how to film and that. For, for, and some of the shots were quite cool. For twenty quid you can't no. not do it. <laughs> well, that's, that's, yeah, for twenty quid it was great. Twenty quid I can make you see heaven, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Twenty quid. No, it's like, not a bargain there. It's, a bargain, yeah. <laughs> it's really good. And like that, well, I've got like I think nearly three thousand. Well, not before, but the next one's free. So <laughs> yeah. well, we get like free shit on the next. Well, one. Benefit, well <laughs> at the rate we're going, pay people twenty pound. Next one's free. People should be paying us for that. Yeah. Like, That'd be quite <laughs> Please nice. come. Please come. No. Um. Yeah, we've got. Yeah, we've got a music video next week. We've got. Have we got a gig well, next week? Yeah. Yeah, one of the B two, and then we've got another oh. one. Uh, 26th, the Owl Sanctuary, one on the 10th of February. Yep. Um, uh, open banking. Yep. I'm looking uh, forward to that. That's the one with Fell Out Boy. In, yeah. One of them's in June. Bum? Got something in June. You've got Epic in June. Epic in studios. June. Epic. Is that that thing that. Um, the charity one. <laughs> That'd be good. Yeah. I th- for, like, There's free food there as well, so I'm well going. <laughs> free. <laughs> Not free, I love free food. Get you anywhere for free food. Yeah. Um, yeah, like, oh, okay. uh, that, was, that was the chair. No, no, no that's not so nice. Um, it sounds even worse for a microphone. Oh, great. You know that. <laughs> well, you're going to get You're going enhan- to enhance it. <laughs> like, it's sound worse. Um, In the, the awkward sound. silence. <laughs> yeah, like, gig wise, we've not got a massive. We, we, we do, but a lot of stuff to be confirmed. As yeah, it yeah. probably is. But then, mm. summer, we're going to think about doing another album or an EP. Yeah, definitely. But um, maybe including other artists in the area. So uh, we did a gig at Christmas with a band called No Story Goes. Yeah. Who they're are quality. They're good really boys. good guys. And their singer said they'd love to have Lily on one of their tracks and they'd love to yeah, feature her like on... Yeah, yeah. Collab, I, think I think a lot more bands should do that. Because yeah. like, all the other sort of genres out there, they always do collaborations. Yeah. And I think the sort of alternative rock genre Same. needs well, more of that. It's not just that. They're sort of like, they've got a... It'd be, I'd love to do something like... Where we mix both our genres together, so you've got a bit of visitors, a bit of no story goes in yeah. there because they do yeah, quite yeah, heavy yeah. stuff, which mm. we love. Yeah, but, but you like, still then get we can mo- still put like the soft sort of like vocals on punky them, rock he's and got stuff like in a there. A really, as well. really good voice he has. As well. yeah, yeah, definitely. I think I yeah. So the next one, I think we're, we're gonna <clears throat> so we're gonna get them on some vocals. We've got a a guitarist who actually taught me and Lou mm-hmm. who we want to do some crazy solos on the album as well but I yes. think we, we might be thinking I, I don't know if we want any more people but it's the more the merrier kind of thing yeah definitely and like we were three drummers car, yeah really <laughs> oh god three drum kits we've got one drum that's bad enough uh, I can say that because you my you can't work a computer anyway it's fine you won't figure it out but that's pretty much a, a 2018 chat. <laughs> 2018 pretty much isn't it yeah so would you like to start a rumour about the visitors a rumour. Rumour. Yeah, yeah, boy. Uh, <laughs> Lily's actually rumor. got more hair than well, any like, man alive. <laughs> I was going to say Lily's a man. She's no. secretly a man. I, I am a man. What? What? 
Yeah. Would, would we start a room? I don't know. Uh, How would well, you start what do you mean? <laughs> I don't, no, I, you I know, think, like bands, they kind of have a thing, and it's like, oh, maybe it is true, maybe it isn't. What and about just, like perks and stuff, like what, little, call of duty? little annoying things? Oh, well, like, oh, oh, things, oh, things like um, uh, Liz, Liz's vegetarian, but she doesn't class chicken as meat or something like that. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> something, something like something that. Like that. Um, <laughs> rumor. I'm just wondering. Oh, Can't <laughs> everyone believes in like flat Earth. No. Which would be brilliant. Do you know what flat earth is, Lily? Well, yeah, that the earth is flat. I could you clap on it? <laughs> I mean, that could be like a Norfolk stereotype, though. So. Yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't know. Rumour. Um, rumour. Let's start a rumour about the visitors. I got attacked by a wolf. That's why our logo is the wolf. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, if anything, okay. you want to put the other way, you attacked a wolf. <laughs> no, no one's going to believe that. Was it just a big dog? <laughs> A chihuahua. I got attacked by a wolf when I was three, and that's why our logo was the Amazing. You can, you can have... think of a better one, that's terrible. Um, start a rumor, that's I cute. can't really start one about us, because we're all just individual dickheads. Well, that's how we're all bad, aren't we? yeah. <laughs> You can't be like, are there idiots? And just like, yeah, we know that. Um, Lily does bare knuckle boxing in her spare time. That's it. That's a rumor. Yeah. Lily, no, and Lily no, no. actually get like, Lily's like a proper no. scrappy fighter. No, no, no. <laughs> You're no. training for UFC. It yeah. Was, it was an un, unvideoed and unmarked fight between Lily and Conor McGregor. Me, yeah, but just, and Lily won. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. Lily does bare knuckle boxing. That's a rumor. <laughs> you watch. She's gonna turn up to one of our gigs and just beat the shit out of all of us. <laughs> <laughs> but she's gonna hear me play a wrong note and just cack me. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that, 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 that'd be that be the rumor. Lily's, what, Lily's a secret UFC. Oh, can I not do something else? Yeah, Lily does bare knuckle boxing. Oh, no. That's what, what I'm doing. People start asking me about it. That's the idea of starting your. Yeah, that's really awkward. Yeah, that's what we want to happen. Can't we do Nathaniel does ballet? <laughs> no, nah, I think you do bare knuckle. But I could it's believe funny, Nathaniel yeah. doing ballet. <laughs> that's the thing. Or I can. F- I'm a pilot or something like that. Why are you trying to get out of beating <laughs> yeah. people up? <laughs> Because the thing is, if people are people were too afraid to ask you, because if it's yeah, true, yeah, you'll yeah. beat them up. Can... All, all in favour of Lily does bare knuckle boxing. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I like that one. Oh, it's a rumour, it may or may not be true. Yeah. Exactly. We'll never know. <laughs> we don't, we, don't, we, don't, we, we don't want to find out. <laughs> exactly, it's not worth delving. <laughs> no. Got to go along with it, though, haven't they? Yeah, yeah. 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 We're doing it for five years. <laughs> <laughs> I killed Since Ali. I was no, 12. <laughs> when they ask you, you go, I don't know, do I? <laughs> Do you want to find out? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Time and time and place, let's go. <laughs> Back outside, outside bro. Bruce, ten minutes. <laughs> me outside, catch me outside, how about that? Yeah. Get that 2013 meme. Uh, <laughs> so anyway. Do you have any advice for aspiring musicians? Don't give up. <laughs> yeah, li- yeah. I, it's a thing of... The hardest thing for me <laughs> as a musician is that you encounter people who are better than you. You encounter people who are doing so much better and you'll there'll be times where you're like, oh, why should I even try when so-and-so is doing better? I used to be quite negative thinking like that, but... It was the you, same. You can, you can always be better. Like, you might see someone who can play a thousand notes a minute and can really, like, shred or singers who can belt their heart out. It doesn't mean that you can't do that. You just need to, you just, need to just keep trying, like, not giving up. Which is the best? Which is the not, Which is the best advice I can give someone? Is just to keep, <laughs> keep <laughs> non visitors reference. <laughs> just drop a little hint. Mm. Yeah, that, that, that's it's the best. Facade. That's that's the best advice I'd give. Is just to not give up. Yeah, I'd, I'd say. Don't care what anyone else is doing. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Yeah, I'd say now. focus more on yourself and don't be judged by other people. Mm. Yeah, because mm. I hate if that people, when bands yeah that they try and compare two bands and they might yeah. be even like totally different styles and it's like. You just can't compare if they're, you know, no. totally yeah, different styles thing. and stuff. Yeah. So, yeah, I hate all that battle of the bands, bollocks, and all that shit. It's just wow. Well, um, I, <laughs> I, I know you've probably, probably, I know you've probably done one. Up. I know, but I just personally think like it's a bit stupid because you'll have like a metal band and then like a pop punk band next, mm. and it's just like, well, that's not an even playing field, is it? Yeah. So. But I mean, if you like win, fair enough. Rules. Oh yeah, if we win, <laughs> we will. Because um, <laughs> we're the best. <laughs> mm, but but no, that's that's some good advice. I like yeah, it. Just keep going. Yeah. Even if you're like, like I always find that because I'm only like grade four to five on guitar, and people are grade eight, and they're like, "Oh, what grade are you?" And I'm like, four, five. 
Mm. They're like, oh, right, okay. Yeah, I was like, well, crazy. why are you judging me yeah. if yeah, it's yeah, on a bit yeah. of paper? Yeah, exactly. So, I mean, like, to heart, you never know I could be quite good compared to what you're seeing. Yeah, exactly. But then, yeah, yeah there's, 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 things. It's, it's lo- there's loads of things. Yeah. It's, it's, it's also, if you're a musician in a band and say, like, the band, like, the band you're in breaks up, that's not a, that's not to say that... Oh, your you'll never, you'll, over forever. Yeah, exactly. It's, a, it's I, an opportunity I can't, to look for something better. I've been loads of bands before this one. Yeah. You have as well. Yeah. Like, literally, this is your first one. Yeah. So, it, like, just because a band breaks up doesn't mean it's the end. You've just got to push through, find new people, try new things. Yeah. Yeah, and you learn from previous experiences. Oh, yeah. Exactly. It makes you a better musician. And oh, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. So don't, like, put all your hopes in the first band. No. Yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> this being Lily's first band, yeah. like, don't, don't get your hopes up. <laughs> well, you can sort of put all your hopes in your first band. You just got to hope that they have as well. Yeah, you yeah, you, find you, that people yeah, you go, got to find oh, the like-minded people. Yeah. You have a guy that you've joined with, sort of like, well, I want a career outside, and then yeah. you're like, you need to find these people that want to go further in music. Got the yeah, same definitely. mindset. Yeah, exactly. Because yeah. I remember my first band, I loved playing and I loved everything about it. They didn't want to be in a band. They yeah. just did it because it was a school project. Yeah, exactly. And it's yeah. sort of it's wounding, breaking up, but then finding people that want to be in a band, want to go further in music, it's just such a nice experience. Yeah, definitely. So now we're going to talk about guilty pleasures. Oh. <laughs> so this is songs or artists that you secretly love, okay. might not want to admit to. Simon's got a gimp suit. <laughs> That's not a song. <laughs> are we talking is that about a rumor? <laughs> <laughs> Is it? Are we talking about guilty pleasures in songs or just yeah, in yeah, things? Songs, songs oh. or maybe a band or an artist. <laughs> Try Faith by George Michael. It's a classic. I love that song so that much. That is a tune. Yeah. Oh. And Careless Whisper. Oh. I'm trying to think. <laughs> Secretly. No, I'd say my little fascination is George Michael. Because mm. I love him. I'm trying to... Th- I really can't think of anything that's sort of guilty. Because I, I, even though I listen to like a lot of rubbish, I'd take, I, I like everything I listen to. No, Fleetwood no. Mac. I love Fleetwood Mac. Who doesn't it's like guilty food? pleasure? I'm, I'm talking good. about like cheese. Like I know there's really no such thing as a guilty pleasure. Oh, Big Shack, man's not hot. Oh. <laughs> I generally actually love that song. Oh, oh I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> but that's that's the reaction I'm looking yeah. for. That, that kind. Yeah. That's yeah. a guilty pleasure when you piss someone off by saying it. Yeah. Just like, I, oh my god, how can you listen to I that? I generally love that so song. You like Big Shack, ladies into J A J L S. Or I like Reach for the Stars by S Club Seven. Ooh. See. Mm. I should have covered that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh. those are some good guilty players. Yeah, that was Damn. good. That was deep. <laughs> it was. Energetic. <laughs> All right. So do you do you want to play another track? Yes, yeah, do it. Love to. Would so, you like Would you like to introduce it? This is it so right now. <laughs> <laughs> I can't feel it. 
so that's that's pretty much the end of the interview. Awesome. Sweet. Yeah. It's been a fun experience. It's been an absolute pleasure. Yeah. <laughs> We've had burgers and... Yeah, yeah. yeah. We, yeah. we had a sneaky break, which you won't be able to tell because of the amazing editing. Mm. And we also... <laughs> I had a Why laugh. Are you laughing? <laughs> Why Don't you laugh? judge me. What are you trying to say? <laughs> and you guys did an acoustic session as well. Yeah. Yeah, that was fun. Which will come out the following week from this interview. That's so sweet. stick around subscribe to the channel you'll be able to watch that yeah where can everyone follow you on social media well we're on facebook yeah with the visitors with the one with the wolf logo <laughs> uh we're on twitter as well yeah. which i think is the visitors with a three instead of and e. that's the same for our instagram yeah and yeah. then the instagram as well and then um we've got uh spotify we're on itunes as well and deezer and deezer as and well. soundcloud mm -hmm. yeah yeah, that's pretty and much awesome. You got some, and you got some stuff on YouTube as well. Oh yeah, we've got a YouTube uh, we've got, channel. Yeah, song. <laughs> we, we've got a, a song. Just one. <laughs> we've got a version of you doing a "Bring Me the Horizon" song. Uh, yeah, I've got me covering a "Bring Me the Horizon" song. And then we've got our music video for "Facade," yeah. which is yeah. up. And then which I, is totally bogus, bro. Which get get down nice. on it. And then we'll have another music video up on there in the, in the coming coming weeks. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And you'll have three tracks eventually. On local distortions channel as well. Yeah, yeah that'd be sweet. We'll make, we'll make sure to plug that on our <coughs> yeah. social media aisles. Yeah. Yes, yeah. definitely. So, yeah, you can follow Local Distortion on Facebook as well. We're on Twitter. Obviously, subscribe to this YouTube channel. And we do loads of behind the scenes stuff on Instagram as well. And we have t shirts as well, which you can purchase by just. Yeah. We have t shirts as well. Yeah, we got t shirts too. Yeah, we got t shirts <laughs> right, right. <laughs> I didn't know it's a competition. <laughs> and bourbons. <laughs> what? I don't know, I'm trying to sell it. Or, or biscuits. <laughs> yeah. Biscuits. Fantastic. Fox's biscuits. We've got deep pan peaks. <laughs> <laughs> if you subscribe to this channel, you get 50% off of a deep dish. Please don't say that. Only in Orange. We're going to get so many emails being like, where's my pizza? <laughs> You've got to come to a gig first. Yeah. <laughs> Free pizza at the gig. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, thanks, yeah. guys. Thank you. Cheers.